hi welcome children uh, firstly welcome all the grade 6 students to today my video today i am going to teach unit 6 of the grade 6 science unit 6 of the grade 6 science right what is the unit 6 of the grade 6 science the unit 6 of the grade 6 science is sounds and hearing sounds and hearing right okay now we are going to learn about under this topic sounds and hearing right under this topic firstly we have to learn about first we have to learn about producing sound producing sound right now think about how to produce the sound how to produce the sound right sound is produced by vibration sound is produced by vibration it means sound is produced by vibration of the somethings vibration right okay uh, now when we consider about you can observe the your thoughts right when you talk in touch the your thoughts you can be heard you can be identified clearly sound is produced vibration and also in our uh, in this video next i will explain some activities to identify the way of producing sound right after you study the this activity you will be able to understand sound is produced by the vibration right now we have learned about under the producing sound sound is produced by vibration sound is produced by vibration right now we know how to produce the sound now we know how to produce the sound right then we will go to then we will go to some activity then we will go to study some activities right right in our previous slide we have learned about how to produce the sound of no? right in the slide we got some conclusion sound is produced by vibrating something right after that you can make a like that chord by using the cardboard or crystal board right firstly you can listen the uh, sound of the your friends or any other sounds after that you can wear those pair onto your ears and after that you can hear the sound right you will be able to understood right uh, when you we are like that cardboard corns you will be clearly hear to the sound right oya rata puluwan puthe mena me wage corn deka kandu adagana me deka kan dekata dala iwara vela oya rata nehema nattam meeta kalin awasthawe meka deka palandala sabde ahanna kalin oya rata samana vidira sabde ahanna puluwa ida passe me deka kanata me vidira hai karala oya la sabde ahun kan dunnot em oya rata ඉතාම පහසුවෙන් ශබ්දය අර කලින් අවස්ථාවට වඩා හොඳින් ඇල වෙනවා. ඒකට හේතුව තමයි පුතේ මෙන්න මේ වගේ කොටසකින් කරන්න මොකද්ද පුතේ ශබ්දය කනට ගොනු කරන ප්‍රමාණය වැඩි. ඔයාලගේ ear lobes අපි කම්පෙති කියලා කියන්නේ කම්පෙති වලින් වෙන්නේ තොන්නොය process එකම තමයි right. අපි එහෙනම් මේ activity එක ගැන කතා කරා right. Then we will go to our next activity. Right. Next activity right. This is the bicycle bell. Right. You can ring the bicycle bell by using this part of the bicycle bell after that when you ring the bicycle bell by using these parts you can touch the upper side of the bicycle bell right by this activity you will be able to understand right when you ring in the bicycle bell when touching the this space the surface right this surface is vibrated so it is the it is the conclusion if not conclusion this of activity is vibration is if not sound is produced due to the vibration sound is produced due to the vibration right okay then we will go to our next activity next activity right okay this is the a small drum a small drum you also can make the drum by using the membrane of the balloon no right after that firstly you have to make like that drums and then you can put some pieces of cardboard or rigid foam onto the drums onto the surface of the drum if not membrane of the drum after that you can produce the sound uh, <coughs> by touching or by touching the touching onto the membrane of the balloon after that you will be able to see when you produce when sound is produced these particles is move up and down up and down right so it is also the conclusion to get the sound is produced by vibration sound is produced by vibration right however now we have got conclusion sound is produced by vibration sound is produced by vibration right under the sound and hearing 
firstly we have learnt about the sound under the sound we have learnt about how to produce the sound how to produce the sound right then we will go to our next topic our next topic is sources of sound sources of sound in our previous lessons in the energy we have learnt about the sources of energy under that topic the sources of energy was the resources that can be produce energy after that in the unit 5 if not light and light if not uh, light and scene right in this lesson we have learnt about the sources of the light sources of light means the resources that emit lights that emit lights right okay in the sound lesson we have to learn about the what is the sources of sound what is the sources of sound right what is the sources of sound the sources of sound mean the objects the objects that produce sound are called sources of sound right now we have learned about what is mean by sources of sound no sources of sound mean the objects that produce sound the objects that produce sound are called sources of energy sources of energy right again think about what is the sources of sound the objects the objects that produce sound the objects that produce sound are called sources of sound sources of sound right now we have learnt about what is mean by sources of sound no now we have learnt about what is mean by sources of sound right then we will go to learn about what are the examples for the sources of sound now we are going to learn about the sources of sound if not examples for sources of sound animals animals can produce sound no animals can produce sound therefore animals belongs to the sources of sound animals belongs to the sources of sound due to animals can produce sound and also various types of object now various types object can produce sound therefore various types objects also belongs to the sources of sound next one musical instrument we know musical instrument can produce sound no musical instrument can produce sound therefore musical instrument belongs to the sources of sound right now we have learnt about what is the sources of sound under the sources of sound we have learnt about the objects that produce sound are called sources of sound after that we have learnt about examples for the sources of sound no what are they animals various types of objects musical instrument are the sources of sound if not examples for the sources of sound right then we will go to learn about the hearing of sound hearing of sound firstly we have learnt about production of the sound after that we have learnt about the uh, sources of sound now we are going to learn about the hearing of sound hearing of sound right now when we consider about the hearing we can hear we can hear the sound we can hear the sound of the drum we can hear the sound of the drum only when the sound enters to our ear only when the sound enters the ear right now think about we can hear we can hear we can hear the sound we can hear the sound we can hear the sound only we can hear the sound of the drum we can hear the sound of the drum only when the sound enters the our ear enters to the our ear right if sound is not enters to the our ear sound is not hearing sound is not hearing right so sound should be enters into the our ear to hearing if not for hearing right okay now we have learnt about now we have learnt about we can hear the sound of the drum only when the sound enters to our ear right ear is the organ ear is the organ it is a sense organ no ear is the organ which senses sound ear is the organ which senses sound right now we have learned two points under the hearing of sound right first we have learned about we can hear the sound of the drum only when the sound enters to our ear after that we have learned about 
Ear is the organ which senses sound. Ear is the organ. Ear is the organ which senses sound. Senses sound, no? Right now when we consider about the eyes, eyes are the organ which senses the scene. Nose are the organ which senses the smell. Right? And also ear is the organ which senses the sound. Right? We cannot hear in without ears. Right? Ear lobes help to direct the sound into the ear. Right? Ear lobes. Ear lobes kila can put a kampeti. Ear lobes help to the help to direct the sound into the ear. Direct kyan putte yomukarana. Direct the sound into the ear kila kyan kana tulata shabde yomukarana. Meneme ear lobes kina vedagatino. Ear lobes kina vedagatino. Ear lobes kila can putte kampeti. Kampeti. Right? Now we have learned about three points under this topic. No, right? Firstly, we have learned about the we can hear the sound of the drum only when the sound enters to our ear. After that, we have learned about ear is the organ which senses sound. Right? Finally, we have learned about finally we have learned about ear lobes help to direct the sound into the ear. Right? Next one, ear can be damaged. Ear can be damaged by putting damage external object to each the ear. Each can put a kasanama. Each the ear can put a kana kasi mata. Bahira draw via kana tula to damima magin. Kanata hani venna pulwanlu. Ear can be damaged by putting external objects to each the ear. Each the ear fight. Next one. If the ear is damaged, Hearing will be big, right? If the ear is damaged, Kanata Hani Unot Mogadevenabuti, hearing will be weak. Ape Ahima Durwala Venolo. Right now we have learnt about hearing of sound. Under the hearing of sound, we have learnt about we can hear the sound of the drum only when the sound enters to our ear. Ear is the organ which senses sound. After that, we have learnt about Ear lobes help to direct the sound into the ear. After that, we have learned about ear can be damaged by footing external objects to each the ear. Finally, we have learned about if the ear is damaged, hearing will be weak. Hearing will be weak, right? Next one, right? This is the drum, no? This is the ear lobes and ear, right? When sound is produced by the drum, this sound travel from drum to the ear as the waves ear as the waves the this ear lobes this is the ear lobes this ear lobes help to direct the sound into the ear help to direct the sound into the ear if ear lobes is not present this sound is not enters into the ear and sound is not hearing sound is not hearing therefore the ear lobes is most important for hearing ear lobes is most important for hearing Right, then we will go to our next topic. Right, right. Now we are going to learn about the diversity of sounds. Diversity of sounds. Before learned about the diversity of sound, we have learned about production of sound, sources of sound, hearing of sound. Right now we are going to learn about the diversity of sound. Sound is different, no? Sound is different. If not, different types of the sound can be hearing from the environments different types of the different forms of the sound can be hearing from the environment right firstly we will go to learn about the natural sound if not when we consider about the sound sound can be divided into the two groups sound can be divided into the two groups one of them is natural sounds and artificial sound now we are going to learn about the natural sound so let's go to learn about what is the natural sound what is the natural sound natural sound mean some sounds some sounds that we hear some sounds that we hear in the environment in the environment are produced naturally are produced naturally some sound samahara shabda that we hear api ahana in the environment parisariya tula api ahana samahara shabda are produced nipada venavalu Naturally, swabhavika. Right, Balanuku. Some sounds that we hear in the environment are produced naturally. Right. 
those sounds are known as natural sounds no right then we will go to what are the examples for the natural sounds sound of the wind is produced in the environment naturally therefore sound of wind is belongs to the natural sound natural sounds sound of the waterfall sound of the waterfall is also produced in the environment naturally therefore sound of a waterfall is also belongs to the natural sound next one sound of birds sound of birds sound of birds is also produced naturally in the environment therefore it is also belongs to natural sound it is also belongs to natural sounds next one barking of a dog barking of a dog barking of a dog is also a sound produced naturally in the environment therefore it is also belongs to natural sounds right now we have learned about what is mean by natural sounds no right then we will go to learn about then we will go to learn about look at some picture no right this is the birds this birds is produce sound in the environment naturally right sound in the sea sound in the barking of the dog sound in the waterfall sound of the lightning are the examples for the natural sounds natural sounds right now we have learned about the natural sounds then we will go to learn about the artificial sound artificial sound right what is the artificial sound artificial sounds mean there are artificial sounds that are made by man using equipment right. let's go to learn about what is the artificial sound now we have learned about what is the natural sound now we are going to learn about the artificial sound artificial sound mean there are artificial sounds that are made by man using equipment if not sound produced by man made using equipment man made equipment if not sound is produced by man made equipment is known as artificial sounds what are the examples for the artificial sounds sound of a car sound of a car produced by man made equipment no therefore it is belongs to the artificial sound sound of the school bell the school bell is the instrument that made by the man so sound produced by the school bell is also belongs to the artificial sound it is not a natural sound of an aeroplane aeroplane is the instrument that produced by the man therefore the produced sound of the aeroplane is also belongs to artificial sounds next one sound made by guitar guitar is also a instrument that made by the man so sound produced by the, if not sound made by a guitar also belongs to artificial sound now we have learned about what is mean by artificial sounds and what are the examples for the artificial sound right then we will go to learn about the some picture that represent the artificial sounds this is the aeroplane aeroplane is an instrument that made by the human the sound produced by the aeroplane is belongs to the artificial right boat if not jet and also mic uh, grass cutter those are the instrument that produced by the man no and also therefore the sound produced by the each instrument is also belongs to the artificial sound artificial sound next one music and noise right now we are going to learn about the music and noise right before the music and noise we have learned about natural sound and artificial sound right then we will go to learn about the music and noise sound that are sun or plate sound that are sun or plate rhythmically rhythmically are known as music sound that are sun sun ke anukute gayu plate ke ane vayu gayu saha vayu shabd rhythmically taalekata neda taalekata gayana kirimak nattam taalekata vaadane kirimakata api kiyana puthe mokadda kiyana music kiyala kiyana sound that are your sun sound that are sun or plate rhythmically are known as music sound that are sun or plate rhythmically are known as music examples sound created by violin sound created some sound created by the violin is rhythmically you no know? if it is rhythmically it is belongs to the music sound created by flute 
if it is uh, rhythmically it is also belongs to the music right now we have learned about what is meant by music and some examples for the music right then we will go to learn about the another point sound that are not rhythmic sound that are not rhythmic it means there is not a rhythmic are known as noise sound that are not rhythmic are known as noise what are the examples for the noise noise of traffic noise of the traffic is not a rhythmic no therefore it is a noise and also noise of machines in a factory machines in the factory it is also not a rhythmic therefore it is also belongs to the noise next one noise of a fair and also when the sound of music is increased it too can be disturbance when the sound of music sangeetheka una shabde wedi karana kota mokadde wenu ute it can be a disturbance eka baada kari wenna puluwan lu right now we have learned about what is the music and what is the noise right then we will go to learn about creating equipment to produce sound right you have to do this activity in the home creating equipments creating equipments to produce sound right now think about this instrument you can make by using tonic lids no and then like that instrument cardboard guitar tin guitar right okay those are the instrument that produce sound no right you can make like that all the instrument at the form all the instrument produce the sound therefore all the instrument are belongs to the sources of the sound right first one next one given below are some other equipment which produce sound in the same ways as the tin guitar you made right now think about those are the musical instrument no those are the musical violin guitar sitar those are the some music instrument the method of producing sound of the these instrument are similar to sound produced by the tin guitar tin guitar ke shabde nipadavunu krama vedeyata thamai puthe menna me musical instrument wala shabde nipadavin given below are some other equipment which produce sound in the same way samana krama ekata as the tin guitar you made oyala hadapu tin guitar ke shabde hadana vidiyata thamai nipadana vidiyata thamai puthe menna me instrument wala shabde nipadavin menna ilage ekata instrument produce sound in the same way as flute eke ene mokadda puthe flute eke shabde nipada wena kramayata samana me balanako oyalata menna me kriya karakama gedara idamma karanna puluwa pam bata tika karagana eka samana neda vivida digawal walin menna me vidida kapala puthe eka me patta kelawa eka ha samana vidiyata tiyenna eka diyen mema cello tape ekin otanna puluwan puthe idu passe yala mekata pimbina kota eka shabdeyak mekata me eka eka me eka ekata wena wema pimbina kota puthe pita wena shabde wenas ඒකට හේතුව තමයි මේ වතුර ශබ්දය නිපද වෙන්න පුතේ මේ ඇතුලේ තියෙන වාතය කම්පණය වෙලා. ඒතර මේ කම්පණය වෙන වායු කඳේ දිග වෙනස් වීම නිසා තමයි පුතේ මේ වගින් එක එක ශබ්ද නිපද වෙන්නේ. ඒ වගේ මේ ෆ්ලූට් එක තියෙනවා නේද ෆ්ලූට් එකේ ශබ්දය නිපද වෙන්නේත් වායු කඳක් කම්පණය වෙලා පුතේ. ඒ ක්‍රමයට තමයි මෙන්න මේ උපකරණ වලත් ශබ්දය නිපද වෙන්නේ. මේ උපකරණ වල ශබ්දය නිපද වෙන ෆ්ලූට් එකේ සවුන්ඩ් එක නිපද වෙන ක්‍රමයට සමාන ක්‍රමයකින්. right next one. instrument that played are played as same as a drum ekena drum eke sound eka nipada wena widiyata oyala me widira drum ekak heduna me drum eka neda sound eka nipada me meka thuru thindana kampana mage me patale siddha wena kampana mage puthi etara menna me bereya tiyenama jathu mokathin rabana tiyenama ida passe api gatho tabla tiyenama ida passe විවිධ නේද උපකරණ තියෙනවා උඩක් තියෙනවා විවිධ උපකරණ තියෙනවා මේ හැම එකකම ශබ්දය නිපද වෙන්න පුතේ මොකද්ද මෙන්න මේ ක්‍රමයට එහෙනම් නේද මියුසිකල් ඉන්ස්ට්‍රුමන්ට් ගත්තොත් මේ වගේ ශබ්දය නිපද වෙන පුතේ එකිනෙකට වෙනස් විවිධයි රයිට් නෙක්ස්ට් වන් දැන් ඔන්න මේ පාඩමට අදාළ පුතේ සියලුම තියරි කොටස් ටික අපි කතා කරලා ඉවරයි රයිට් නව් වී ආ ගෝයින් ටු ලර්න් අබවුට් දි එක්සර්සයිස් ඔෆ් දි ලෙසන් රයිට් ක්වෙස්චන් නම්බර් 1 ෆිල් ඉන් ද බ්ලැන්ක්ස් වித ද ගිවන් වර්ඩ්ස් මෙන්න මේවා දීලා තියෙන words වලින් අපි උත්තර ලියන්න ඕනේ. මෙතන අවශ්‍ය කරන හිස් තැන් ඔයාලට අවශ්‍ය කරන උත්තර ටික දීලා තියෙනවා. sources of sound, noises, sensitive, vibration, music, sound, loud and ear. right. firstly we will get the read the question and then we will write the answer. sound is produced by of an object. 
right in the lesson we have learned about sound is produced by the vibration no so correct answer for the space one is vibration 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 is the correct answer vibration answer for the this space is vibration vibration of the object and then object that produce sounds are known as object that produce sounds are known as sources of sound so answer for this space is sources of sound sources of sound object that produce sounds are known as sources of sound sources of sound sources of sound right next one ear is an organ which is which is what is the answer ear sensitive sensitive to sound sensitive to sound sensitive to sound next one rhythmic sound are known as rhythmic sounds are known as music no rhythmic sounds are known as music rhythmic sounds are known as music and unrhythmic sounds are known as noises noises if not noise noises unrhythmic sounds are known as noises next one by hearing by hearing loud noise loud noise by hearing loud noises loud noises ear can be ear can be get affected ear can be get affected ear can be affected it is our due to use sound you sound you sound you sound without disturbing others right now we have got the answers for the question number one right then we will got the get the answer for the question number two question number two right question number two put the following sentence put the following sentences are the true foot tick mark and if wrong foot cross mark with the within the brackets right question number one fill sorry ear lobes help to direct the sound to the ear in the theory we have learned about ear lobes is important to direct the sound no if this statement is correct so this statement is put the right sorry we can put the tick mark here next one the sound of the tabla is tabla is produced the same way or produce the violin the violin sound of the violin is produced by the same way of the flute no therefore this statement is wrong this statement is wrong next one the sound of a flute is produced in the same way as in a trumpet sound of the flute it is correct it is correct the sound produced by the flute and sound produced by the trumpet is equal therefore this statement is correct most of the time rhythmic sounds are not disturbance to the ear most of the time rhythmic sound are not disturbance to the ear it is also correct next one it is suitable for people who work in places of loud noises to wear ear protector it is suitable it is yes it is, this statement is correct right now we have got the answer for the all the exercise contained in the unit 6 unit 6 right okay now we have finished all the theory and uh, exercise in the unit 6 of the grade 6 science and also don't forget subscribe like and share my youtube channel because uh, all the lessons contained in the grade 6 to 11 single medium and english medium all the full video i will upload it to the youtube in near future therefore if you want to watch all the lessons uh, Subscribe my my YouTube channel and get the notification right. Okay, have a nice day for all.